What is up, everyone? It is Kesmir, and I am back with The Walking Dead. Uh, last time we played, uh, we were trying to find some shelter uh, so we could have this baby, and we ran into that, uh, they, I don't know, that crippled guy, and he had a bag of medicine, and I still feel really bad about it uh, that, we, we, that we nabbed those goods. We should have let him keep them. Um, I, I have a feeling that's going to bite us in the rear end in the future here. But I'm not going to go back and change any choices, so we're just going to live with the choices we made. So we'll see what happens next. <clears throat> Hopefully it doesn't hurt too much that we took all those medication. I'm just, I'm worried about Kenny's eye and I don't know. He's got his stuff going on, too. I'm sure he's got his own emergencies. It's the apocalypse. What can you expect? I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you, you're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared and hurt. Chasing us. He died to keep us safe. Jesus. Of course. Of course he did. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's going to be a girl. Oh, yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. I've got a feeling this one's a Good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Uh, oh, shit. I got this. We ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while, and I'm not saying I don't trust him, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on him. Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Well, maybe you should start moving her to the hideout. Doesn't look like she's got much time. Take a peek around here. See if there's any goodies before we leave. So that's where we were at. This looks like where we are right now. I wonder if Mike and Bonnie have found anything at the museum. No, we gotta head all the way up there. Why did everybody just walk together and then split up, split off from the observation deck? <laughs> you know, I thought everybody was going in separate directions. Kind of like when you're, when you say bye to a friend, but you're both going in the same way, same direction. It's kind of awkward. Fallen, but never forsaken. 
Any other goodies to look at? I think that's it, guys. We can talk to Kenny again. I don't know. Why wouldn't you be? <laughs> oh, I can give her pills? Should we give her pills? Let's give her pills. Jane and I found some medicine. Is it safe for Rebecca to take? Well, it should make her more comfortable anyway. Valentine, you are my favorite person in the entire world. Ah. Feeling Rebecca, like poo poo, but I didn't think it would hurt like this. Okay, I'll stop wasting your time and leave. Let's go see what Mike and Bonnie are up to. It'd be pretty weird for Bonnie to double cross us now after everything that's happened. Well, looks like somebody was here. Hey, Clem. I thought you went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Observation deck with the gift shop. It's way up high and pretty safe from the wind. Oh, that's great. Just give me like 10 more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty handed. What? I just want to help. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I'll watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. Jane said these don't work anymore. No, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also really loud. Good point. Hmm. Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Maybe I could give it to Rebecca. That's a good idea. I'm sure she'll really appreciate it. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you do. I haven't always used the best judgment. We can't put Rebecca in a Confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Well, better to put it to good use. At this point, who cares? I guess he would. Lee you think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way? Oh, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with me. No, I wanted to. Never mind. What would, ha what would have in the baby? Yeah. There get water and blankets just stuff. to get out of here. Watch where you step. You guys could probably find stuff a lot better if you'd stop standing like in one spot. And actually like search stuff. Nothing but junk in there. Trust me. Any luck? No, not so much. Unless you want some broken glass. I tell you, I sure don't like being near a graveyard with the world the way it is now. Where things are now, you're in a graveyard all the time. Yeah, true enough. Empty. No.
Wow. What's this say? Over here. Oh, is that water? Water. Bottled and clean. It's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'll that make, make noise. A lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, I mean, maybe. All right, all right. I'll go. Thanks, Clem. Just open the door from the other side. Mike will carry those things out. Might be a bit heavy for you. I'm stuck. Okay, maybe I push from... Oh gosh. That happened. Oh, good moving. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Thanks, Mike. Yeah, no problem. I'm so sorry about that, Clementine. We should have been more careful. It's no big deal. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Oh yeah, good luck. Hey, I got this. Sweet. That looks pretty heavy. Oh, uh, that's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy. But at least his shell were always full. We'll make a plan. Everyone will have enough. I hope so. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Come on, stick close. We're just gonna leave the water? We just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I need the shit out of that raccoon. Ha! <laughs> Not like, I mean, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Uh oh. Where is it? I think it went over there. Over here! Oh, I pressed X on it. Not with the walkers out there. Oh, it's got babies. Let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. That's life, though. Eat or be eaten. We don't have much time to waste. You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. I could do this all day. No! No! Shit! Shit! Oh, God! Breathe no! like I told you. Okay. 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 Oh, God. Oh, God. So oh. why, like I said, why hasn't he been moving her? Shit. Walkers. You and Jane found. I'll show you. Good. Someone help me up. 
Oh, God, there's so many. We uh, gotta get out of here. Mike, the water. On it. Kenny's got to take out some frustrations anyways. Clem, I, I don't think he's okay. He's losing it. I mean, that, that isn't... I don't think he's okay either. This is bad. Uh. Kenny! Damn it! Yeah, we need you, Kenny, for baby delivery. Oh my. Oh Jean, my. Jesus, Clem, it's just not. Um. Jane? What? Clem, listen. Uh. Wait, what's going on? In here. Let's get you comfortable. Jeez. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny, what's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. The walkers are right behind us. We have to keep them from getting up here. There's still the stairs. No! Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. Right over Shit. here. Uh. They're coming up the stairs. Here. Uh, we should. You want to help. Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. Shit, that's a lot of them. We need everyone out here. Well. Going outside. I'll help pull them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. Here they come. Here. We can't let them up here. Got a few bullets. Gunfire's just gonna draw more of them. We should be using our uh, our melee weapons and stabbing them through the. Uh, the gate there. There are too many of them. Shit! Keep shooting! They are not getting up here! Find something to block this gate! Help us! The... The cannon. We could block the gate with this! I'll help, I'm coming. Excuse me. Oh, oh no. Well. What the fuck is going on out there? Oh jeez, get inside, get inside. Get back, get back. Oh, shit. oh. oh. no. Oh. Fuck, fuck, hurry. I can't hold on. Take my hand. What? We're gonna make it up here. Fuck! Does this shit ever end? We need to break the rest of the deck. She's right. She's right. Drop the whole deck. Drop the. Are you fucking crazy? We'll get down later. Do that? I don't know. Just look around. <laughs> oh. It's too thick. It's metal. Dang it. Let's see how that's gonna work. That'll work. We bust that, the whole thing comes down. Lose me. They're getting closer. Clementine. Move it. Oh, there we go. Come on. I'm going as fast as I can. Watch it. Son of a bitch. Oh, 
now we just be quiet after she has the baby, but good luck with that. Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole world? He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. <coughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Yeah, it's just... Do you want to hold him? Could I? Of course. Your family. Here. Oh. You slept, Kenny. How about two years ago? I'm fine. <laughs> well, somebody's got to watch you while Mama gets your beauty sleep. Oh, you never forget that smell. She's not looking so good. Oh, are we not going to give her the code? Psych, you don't get one. You get to be cold. Oh, shit. What are you doing? Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. What about Luke? What about him? Aren't you guys... Look, Luke's a nice guy, but it's not like that. And it can't ever be like that. Oh. Well, that's it then. You know, Jamie, Sarah, I'm not gonna stick around and watch it happen to you too. You know the score. You're a smart kid. But I thought you believed in me. I do. But give it enough time and everyone's luck runs out. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do, like it's all one happy family. But when push comes to shove... Yeah, I know. Good. Okay. Kind of want to go away there. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Versatility is not overrated. Thanks. Yeah. I, um... Uh, I gotta go. No hogs? Mm -hmm. 
Bye, I guess. All right, guys, we're going to stop this one here. So like, comment, subscribe. See you in the next one. Kazmir out. Ha ha ha.